What up, y'all? It's your boy Hack. To that tech. To that get. That. Jackie check. And yo, right now, I'm having some. Ahroe guandule. Some Benny chicken. And some potato salad. We celebrating like it's New Year's, you know what I mean? Or like it's Christmas up in here. Word. When I when we cook at home, this how we sell that's how we cook every day. Forget the holidays, man. This is every day. This is some healthy eating for y'all, you know what I'm saying? Word up. Ain't nothing better than this, baby. Nothing better than this. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Word. So I want to talk about something, man. This cat named, um, mmm. Delicious. It's not like Spanish food. Not like Spanish food, baby. There is nothing like Spanish food. You heard me? Yeah. Dig in, baby. Dig in. Word. So, I'm going to talk about this cat. Blue Boy. Everybody been talking about him. I never spoke about him yet. I do know he's from the Lower East Side. I know this dude that knows him personally. You know what I mean? He got pictures with him. And everything. He's from the Lower East Side too. Um. So what's Cat Blue Boy? I guess he's a crip, right? I mean, I see him. He got. A, he got um. Blue bandana, blue everything. He keep it blue. Um, he murdered. Um, he didn't. I don't. Um, he killed Larry Davis, something like that. I don't. I don't know that story. But um, I I I heard on Black TV that he got three bodies. Um, he caught three bodies. Um, he did thirty nine years in jail, and he got out. And now he's back in. You know what I'm saying? And now he's back in. This cat named Blue Boy. It's interesting because I saw something about uh, about the LES. You know what I mean? The neighborhoods. The LES. Shout out to True Life. You know what I mean? Um, shout out to Ray's. Ray's the Ratchet. If y'all familiar with him. But um, I don't think Ray's likes me too much anymore. You know what I mean? I'm saying I don't know why you know what I'm saying but Ray's had had issues with a lot of people like <coughs> like true like he's, 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 he's had issues with he's had issues with true life he's had issues with, with um I heard he's had issues with um with uh what's his name uh from the beat nuts he's had issues with uh Psycho less. So everybody he works with, he's had issues with. You know what I mean? So I don't think the problem, I think the problem is raised. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect to him, but shout out to him. But um, it is what it is. So so this cat blue. And so I, I saw this documentary online about hoods, 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 about um, uh, hoods online, like, it's this is this dude who goes to everybody's hood and, and, and interviews 
them in, in their hood, you know what I'm saying? They got they got all neighborhoods. They got Queens, they got they got Cali, they got Brooklyn, they got um they did LES and it's crazy how I, I don't see rays in there. I don't see true life. I would love to have seen true life and raising them in there. But I guess, <clears throat> you know, they moved out the hood. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you got to move out the hood. You know what I mean? Because the hood don't always love you when you, when you, when you, when you making it happen. They don't always love you. You know what I'm saying? So I understand that. But um, Blue Boy, he came right back to the hood, man. And, um. He was there, um, repping his hood, and um, with with some other LES cats, and um, he seemed very real to me. He seems like a humble dude. I saw him a hot boxing. I saw him a hot boxing. And Mike Tyson, he was locked up with Mike Tyson too. I saw how long he'd been locked up that he was locked up with Mike Tyson. That is crazy. You know what I mean? Spanish food for y'all. Um, he came out. That's my doggy over there, you know. He gets loud sometimes. Y'all already know that. So he came out and he went back in. Supposedly some cat um, at a dispensary gave him a job to be a lookout, kind of like a security. You know, I, I don't know if he was on parole. I don't know if he was on probation, but... You know what I'm saying? But he just got out, I think. But he did 39 years, you know what I'm saying? Why why would you give why would you do that to somebody who just got out? Like, I know he need a job, but come on. Put him behind the cash register or something, man. You know what I'm saying? Um put him as a stock in the back or something like don't put him at security, man. That's not a good job, man. It's, I mean, it's not smart. You know what I mean? That's definitely not smart. Because if something go down, you know he's going to get busy. And look what happened. He ended up back in the slammer. You know what I mean? So he was a, a career criminal who claimed to fame includes the prison yard slaying of one of the Big Apple's most notorious outlaws is back behind bars after being charged. I guess they're talking about Larry Davis. Now, I don't know too much about Larry Davis' story. You know what I'm saying? Maybe y'all do, but I got I to gotta do more research on that. Big Apple's most... Notorious Outlaws is back behind bars after being charged with attempted murder in the shooting outside of a Manhattan weed spot. The Post has learned. Louis Blue Boy Rosado. That's funny because True Life has that same last name, Rosado. I wonder if they related. Rosado, 56, was paroled. Wow, he's on parole, man. See what I'm saying? From prison last year after serving 39 years for murder, including the stabbing death of Larry Davis, who famously wounded six cops during a shootout in the Bronx in 1986, police sources said. Okay, so that's the story. I was too young, you know what I mean? I didn't know that story. Rosado, a reputed member of the Crip Street Gang, has now been accused of shooting 25-year-old man during a dispute outside of a legal marijuana shop in the East Village, <laughs> according to the sources and court records. He has killed a murderer in jail and he has killed while free on the street. One law enforcement source familiar with Rosado's criminal career told the Post. After spending close to 40 years in jail, he shoots another man over a weed spot when he gets out. The source said, is anyone safe from Blue Boy? 
A Manhattan grand jury indicted Rosario last late last month on attempted murder, attempted assault, and gun possession charges for the October 21 shooting on St. Mark's Place. He was arraigned on January 3 and ordered held without bail pending a return court appearance. The notorious gangbanger is on lifetime parole following his near four decades stint in prison record show. In a podcast interview on Vlad TV last year, Rosado matter-of-factly recounted how he got into beef and stabbed Davis 13 times at the Shawanagunk Sh Sh Correctional Facility in 2008 after Davis intervened on behalf of a convicted rapist that Rosado was targeting. While Davis beat all charges other than the legal gun rat for the shootout that left the cops wounded, he was later convicted in 1991 of a Bronx drug dealer's murder. I ended up stabbing him, was out of set, and if it was the actual target, I would have kept stabbing him. He wasn't my target. But he said Davis, also known as Local Larry, got back up, slammed him in the back of the head with a cane, so he turned on the Bronx criminal and repeatedly stabbed him, leaving him mortally wounded. Rosado also claims to have met eventually heavyweight boxing champ Mike Tyson at a juvenile detention facility in the Bronx while both were young troublemakers. He said the two met at the former former spot for a juvenile detention center. So yeah, man. Man, shout out to Blue Boy, man. I hope I hope I hope they drop these charges. I hope it was self defense. And I hope um he comes back out here and um you know what I'm saying? I don't think I don't think he would just go up to somebody and just shoot them for no reason after serving thirty nine years. I think it was self defense as a matter of fact, you know, it gotta be. You know what I mean? So he was definitely defending himself and other people. You know what I mean? And um Um, he shouldn't have been offered that job in the first place. He shouldn't have taken that job. You know what I mean? Anyway, free blue boy. Word up. Free blue boy. Shout out to blue boy. Free him. You know what I mean? It's some raw with guandule, potato salad, banil, and chicken mixed together. You know how we do. You know what I'm saying? Got to keep it balanced. I'm a Libra. We got to keep it balanced. You know what I'm saying? Word, son. Word, son. Keep it balanced. Yeah. Smell good, don't it? All right, man. I'm out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy, Heck, to the tech, to the get that check. And I'm out, man. Catch on next one. You know what I mean?